Hello there and welcome to the Saturday Wrap for Saturday the 1st of May 2021. Yeah, the last month of spring. And to be perfectly honest, it's still rather chilly. There are still frosts around. April, you didn't have much rain, although towards the end you did. But you were cold, sunny but cold. Anyway, um, this is my wrap for the week, the Saturday wrap. I look back on life and things, but I'm still in Perda, um, so politics will be factual. Although that finishes next Thursday the 6th when there is an election and I'll be back to be moaning on about practically everybody much like everything else. Anyway, let's start with the errata from last week. There was no app of the week. Actually, it was Live Score. Um available on iOS and Android, live football and other sporting updates with push notifications. Doesn't cost anything, has ads, mainly betting as you would imagine for sports. And I like it a lot. It's good. And it's free-ish. Uh, right. Okay. So, see if I can remember the word or the phrase of the week. It's watershed. We are now on the change. Yeah. Um, from the 26th, pubs reopened. Although outside and bear in mind what i've just said about april with the coldness and the rain starting back this week um it wasn't the best experience ever however my local spoons the tumble uh, the debating society was there the bar staff were wrapped up well and still had to wear masks although I suspect that's more to do with the local authority checking on them than any chance of catching the Rona especially outside as it was rather blowy still let us hope that the 17th is still on for opening indoors if not I have a feeling I might be off to across the border Anyway, so this time last week, boiler service, speedy boiler service. Um, the guy was excellent and very friendly. And I did my usual thing about uh, giving him some beers. And he deserved it because he works for British Gas and it's fire and rehire, which I am against. But I'm not being political against uh, against about that. Ooh, if I'm gonna slur, this is breakfast. Um, Zia from the London Beer Factory, 9.2% alcohol by volume, tiramisu pastry stout in a tutti frutti glass, velvety creamy. Fruity, lovely mouthfeel, probably due to the oats as well, and a long, uh, fruity, slightly bitter coffee finish. I give it B plus plus and a bit because it is really good, and I will probably fall asleep before long. So, um, yeah, the start was the boiler service, and um, then it was out in the back garden. Um, it was a bit blowy, um, but I planted some lettuce outside, and it's been nearly frosty overnight and whatever. However, the lettuce is now coming through. Also planted some radish. They are not coming through yet. Um, although the rain this week, and I was worried about my potatoes that are actually in the garden and not in the bags. Um, I couldn't tell where they were. Uh, every hole that I dug, when I put the potato in and then covered it over, I put um, some granular fertilizer on the top so I knew its location. That is all uh, dissolved now. And um, 
well, weeds have come up all over the place, and I do not want to go hoeing the thing if there's potatoes underneath, so I have to wait for them to come through to start weeding. If only potatoes were like weeds. Hmm. Anyway, um, the potatoes in the bags, uh, the earlies, the premier from McCain's, they are really coming on. They are needing to be earthed up like the wind. I'm using a real garden compost from Derek for that. I still managed to get bags in there though, despite the fact that I take all the bags out before I put them into Derek. These are the things that you have to deal with as a gardener. Anyway, um, at the end of the day, my skin was feeling a little bit... I had a touch of sunburn. Uh, not enough to take the skin off, but I did go a little bit red, and it was a little bit hot, and um, I'm blaming the wind. You don't notice how hot your skin's getting and how strong the sun is, despite the fact it's still nippy. But yeah, and I am a little bit, well, reddy brown or something like that. Who knows? Oh yeah, also put some mint in. You don't get as much mint in the packets as you used to do. Most of it is all at the one end of the long pot that I put it into. These things happen. Anyway, at least with the rain coming out of the sky, it means I don't have to water so much, which is important for me when you're on a water meter. Hmm. Um, I really run out of things to watch on. Well, Netflix and Prime. Um, so I went back to The Expanse. If you haven't watched The Expanse before, it's excellent. Um, the first three episodes is a bit like uh, Detectives in Space. Stick with it, because once it gets going, it's political and science fiction, unbelievable science fiction as well. And the actors, they're all rather good, and it's well written. Um, so I'm back on that. Um, <laughs> um, Monday, or was it Tuesday? Reddit. 10k karma you have to be into reddit to understand that but finally absolutely finally and um, on monday down to the post box posted off my postal vote one vote for a local candidate i think the second vote was for the area and you had a first and second preference or was that the police commissioner? To be honest, I don't think the police commissioners do that much. Probably go to meetings and such like, but you never hear of what they do. And I just get the feeling that possibly they might just be a waste of money. We shall see anyway. Um, and I didn't think I would do it because I thought it would be packed out. But I went back to the tumble on Monday with my app it's in the car park um, as uh, the tumble doesn't actually have a garden it has a smoking area um, but that's now part of the parking area well you can sit there if you want um, I was really pleased there were beers I know it was cold but I'm back in the groove I'm back in training I'm looking forward to it all. And May, I have a feeling May is going to be the month, which is good. Um, started off with a brood dog. Um, and, but throughout the rest of the week, it was Cascale, and mostly made in Wales. In fact, completely made in Wales. And yesterday, as it started to rain, luckily they have gazebos there, I had a burger. There are no speciality days, so there was no Curry Thursday. They're running a limited menu. But, oh, I could take a day and... Yeah. I won't, though. Um, but I could. <laughs> Tuesday, iOS 14.5. Uh, it takes a while to download. Uh, update to Big Sur as well and TVOS. The big thing for me was the calibration 
um, of screens with Apple TV. Now I heard the Mac and Forth show, which is well worth a listen if you like Macs or iOS. And Carl usually mentions some drinking. Well, not a lot li lately because um, pubs and stuff. Um, but it was mentioned that once you have completed the calibration, the screen tends to look a little bit flatter. Mine did. Um, I wouldn't say the setting change was great. Oh, it might be I was fairly close to being on target in the first place, but it's worth a try. Obviously, you need an Apple TV and an iPhone. But nothing else is required, just software updates. Hmm, it's good. Okay, so, yeah... It was cold. It was cold last night. It's cold now. It is sunny. And I am still the mayor of the tumble. I think good times are ahead. I'm looking forward to summer. I'm looking forward to being away. I'm looking forward to lots of things. Cheers. Comments wherever you see this video. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye, and I'll probably see you next week.